So I think I've stumbled upon the best Roblox scam I've seen so far, and it involves Roblox tutorials on YouTube, and there are a whole bunch of official looking YouTube videos like how to unlock voice chat on Roblox without an ID, it has 25,000 views, this one here has 92,000 views, and it just keeps on going. There are just so many videos with thousands upon thousands of views, and people that have a lot of subscribers, but each one of these videos are malicious. Now to make the scam even more convincible, they actually do have pretty high quality videos. Let's listen to this one here. Hello besties, today I'm gonna show you how to get your Roblox voice chat. In this tutorial you can- You have a narrator, and you have text, and you have music, and if I keep on going they actually have some pretty fancy zooms, as you can see here. Ooh, crazy. Now these videos vary in production quality, like this one here is my favorite. Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you how to drop any Roblox games in Roblox. This is the most easy- this is serious, by the way. This is a video they uploaded to try and scam people. Now, one common thing with all these videos that I've showed you is the link in the description. Every single one blocks guard, blocks guard, blocks guard, blocks guard, blocks guard, blocks guard, blocks guard. If you are looking for a Roblox tutorial and you see like eight different tutorials that all have over 10,000 views showing the same website, that gives you a really good sense of security. But what it shows me is that this is just one big group of scammers. Now, I hate spoiling myself on what's on these scam websites by watching the video, so I decided to just jump on into the website. Now, if I was an unsuspecting victim and believed all these very legitimate YouTube videos, then I would be screwed, but thankfully this video sponsor Guardio has my back. There's a reason why Guardio is featured by Google and has over 1 million installs. It is a very effective browser security tool. Guardio claims to block 100 times more harmful websites and 10 times more malicious downloads compared to its competitors. And the nice thing is that it blocks malware even after you downloaded it because you didn't know it was malware. Are you concerned about online threats such as malware, phishing scams, and your passwords being exposed? Well, Guardio has got you covered. Guardio monitors data breaches to alert you if your information has been leaked, and if you accidentally download a malicious browser extension before using Guardio, Guardio will detect and disable it. Remember, there are hijackers that disguise themselves as a legitimate browser extension, but they can actually steal your Discord or Roblox account, and Guardio knows how to detect and block them. Now you might be asking, what is the best part about Guardio? And honestly, Guardio is just extremely easy to install and use. Simply just download the extension and with one Guardio account, Guardio will keep you and five family members or friends covered. And I have a confession to make. I even need a helping hand sometimes with scams. After a long day of work, I just mindlessly browse the internet and look at whatever the heck I want to see. And when Guardio pops up, my brain turns back on and I keep myself safe from whatever sketchy website I was just about to enter. Guardio is my canary in the coal mine and it is invaluable to me. So, if you want to give Guardio a shot, you can scan your browser for free by visiting guard.io io slash ntts and installing the extension. Also, you can get a seven-day free trial of their premium plan, which includes real-time threat removal. You can also get 20% off your monthly subscription by using my link guard.io slash ntts. So scroll down to that description and click on that bad boy to get an extra layer of protection. Thank you, Guardio, for sponsoring this video. Now, back to exposing the scam, I uh, just decided, you know what, screw this warning, and I click here. The unfortunate thing is that this specific website is down. Now, the nice thing for me, but bad thing for you, is that whenever there's a successful scam that goes down, there will always be copycats or another website with the exact same crap. Now, I do have a collection of newer scams that are legit like two days old. I'm recording on uh, March 16th, and if I open up this link, once again, this bad boy, oh, not happening. You have to understand that like this scam is ongoing and it's constant. Eight hours ago, and this is from someone called Frog Warp. Now, if I click on play, you might notice that we have a character coming back. Click copy key. Oh my goodness, it is the same girl from the very beginning of the video. Now the nice thing about this specific scam and the reason why I picked it is that this link is still active. So I'm going to open it up and this website is blocked but I'm going to click here anyways because I love getting my Roblox account hacked. Now this website tells me to disable my privacy settings which is never a good idea by the way. And I should also note that this website isn't exactly the same as the one in the scam video. So let me just look at the scam video for a second. You might notice that when you visit the website, this is safe-blocks just also taken down, it'll ask you to see text and images copied to the clipboard. And this is a massive, massive, massive red flag. Like, why would it need access to your clipboard? And that's the very important thing I'll talk about later. So I open up Roblox, I go to a game that I want to copy, of course Fashion Famous is my favorite, and Roblox Paintball is the second, but I go to their website, I copy in the game code, I need to start Game Copier. Now this 
scan website's a little busted in a sense. It doesn't work exactly how it should, according to the video, but it still at the end of the day does scam you. I'm supposed to paste in the game ID and I need to paste in the game ID again. Oh, it's just spamming me over and over. Then I need to open games API and it opens this little window. And now this little window here, what they tell you to do is they want you to right click on this window, inspect elements, and it pops up with, you know, your little console thing here. And it tells you to go to your network and then it tells you to refresh the page. So I reload the page and as you can see, there's this game variable. And if we go back through the video and just kind of scroll through their garbage, you will notice that they tell you to copy the game variable because you are copying the game. So of course, I need to right click and copy the game. And it really depends on the scam. They'll either ask you to copy it as PowerShell or copy as literally any one of these. Now, the second you click copy as CURL or copy as PowerShell, your account is compromised. And why is that? Well, the first thing is that if we actually look at the contents of this, you know, copy as CURL bash, so I copy it, I go to my little notepad page and I paste it in. And I'll zoom in a little bit grandma style so we can see it. You'll notice that there's nothing really concerning, but if I keep on scrolling, one eternity later, Roblox security warning, do not share this. And this is your Roblox cookie and sharing this will allow someone to log in as you and steal your Robux and items. But we haven't actually sent it to the scammers yet right? Well, that's where I hit you with the cold water. Remember when we first visited this website, it told me to uh, allow access to clipboard, or at least the video showed you. When you unknowingly right-click on game and you copy as PowerShell or CURL, what you're doing is that you're actually putting it in your clipboard. And once I copy it, this website is going to read my clipboard. It is going to grab this CURL thing, the curl thing that I talked about, that contains your Roblox cookie, and send it off to the website. And you are now compromised. Now, there's two little things I want to talk about this scam that I find quite interesting. First off, you know how this variable or this thing here is called game? Well, you can actually just go to Roblox and literally open up any web page and do roblox.com slash whatever. I'm going to do no text to speech just for the hot meme. Press enter. The Roblox page won't load, obviously, because this isn't an actual URL. But if I open up my console, I press the wrong key. Do I know how to use a computer? No. But when I open up my console and go to the network tab and I refresh the page, as you see at the very top, I have my no text to speech variable. So these scammers can name this whatever the heck they want. They just make you go to a URL that has whatever the variable name is at the end. Now, why do these scammers go through the headache of making you open up your network tab and copying all this stuff? Well, before previously, what they would do is they would make you go to your console and Roblox even told you, stop, do not paste in anything here because you are getting hacked. And even Guardio tells you, I actually really like that. But when you have something as sophisticated as opening up a server error page, copying this thing and it automatically being sent to the website, it's just a scam that's always one one step ahead of you. Now, since this website is a little busted, I'm going to try my best to uh, send my Roblox cookie. Press F12, copy the game, copy as PowerShell. Once again, this website's borked. It doesn't work at all, so I don't have to worry about copying something. But if I copy as PowerShell, I open up my little notepad here, paste in this bad boy, zoom out a little so I can actually use my computer in a, a fast period of time. And there is my Roblox cookie, and I'm just going to change a couple letters from BE to LE, copy all that stuff. And now I'm going to do some crazy stuff. I'm going to try and send my Roblox, well, my modified Roblox cookie to this website. So all I need to do is just open up my little network tab to monitor what's going on. And I'm just going to paste in my PowerShell thing and click, I don't know, start game copier. And wow, the website works and it sent some PHP stuff. And the best part is it throws up a fake error. Oops, we are currently experiencing downtime due to heavy API load. Please allow up to 22 minutes for the game files to be downloaded, aka please allow 22 minutes so that I can hack into your Roblox account and steal everything you have. Now the sad thing is that there's no Discord webhook that I can just completely annihilate and delete, so I will have to go to my favorite website, fish.report, and report this thing as malicious, and go through the very easy, however many step process. Now one final thing I do want to talk about is what happens if you fell for this scam? Well, it's actually extremely easy. All you need to do is just go to your Roblox settings, we need to go to security, scroll down, and we just need to secure sign out and sign out of all other sessions. And once you click sign out, then log out of your account, and then log back in to reset your Roblox cookie. Anyways, that's all I've got, Chief. If this website is still up, feel free to go to fish.report and report the heck out of it, because yes, we want this website taken down. Anyways, bye-bye. I love you. Mwah.